Hello everybody, my name is Gatis Kandis and today I will show you how to make your own hot water bottle. When it's cold in winter and you go to sleep in your bed and sometimes it's a little bit too cold then you want to have a hot water bottle, which of course you can buy from the shops for like 10-20 pounds but if you don't have the money right now or if you're waiting to get one in the meantime you can actually have very super cheap hot water bottle so all you need is an actual water bottle from the shop and then you just drink the water or pour it away whatever and then you fill it up with the hot water either from water tap or wherever you get the hot water from and it's ready to go all you have to do is just make sure the seal is tight as it is now see so just you squeeze the bottle make sure the water is not coming out and it's ready to go i already filled it with hot water let me show you the temperature okay so the temperature right now i got the thermometer here i'm gonna put it in as you can see the temperature is gonna rise up rise up I'm looking in the mirror so I cannot tell what it says. Is it 39? 45 degrees. So I think it's gonna go up to 50 something. I'm gonna wait a little bit. Okay, it's gone up to 52 degrees. I'm gonna take it out now. I'm gonna put the cap back on. Just make sure it's a tight seal so the water is not coming out. And you know what's surprising is that the water temperature is only 50, like 2 degrees, whatever it was. But it actually feels kind of hot. Like I can comfortably hold it with my hands, but if I hold it too long, it kind of gets a little bit hot. So this is the perfect temperature. And now when I put the bottle in the bed, it will last for many hours and it will keep warm. So right now I'm going to put it in the bed for a couple hours and I'm going to come back in like two hours and then I'm gonna measure the temperature again and you will see that it will have dropped only a little bit I'm guessing well maybe it will be like 40 degrees something like that but not much less than that okay I'll, I'll see you in a, in a little bit two hours later so I left the bottle in the bed for two hours I can now feel that it's not as hot as it was before but it is uh, definitely still quite warm and so I'm gonna measure the temperature now again I'm guessing it's gonna be in 40s because it's like yeah it's still it's still very warm. Here we go, putting it in. Putting the thermometer in. Let's see what it says. 27, 30. Okay, it's gonna go up. I'm gonna forward this bit. Okay, now it's reached 41.8 degrees, which is about 10 degrees less than it was two hours ago. So as you can see, it uh, holds the heat for uh, quite a long time. So I'm gonna take this out again. Just gonna put the cap back. So it has to be a tight seal, so no water is coming out. So it's safe to be put in the bed. And so yeah, there you go. This is how you can have a super cheap uh, hot water bottle if you are waiting to get a proper one soon. And just before I go, I'll tell you a little story about myself. Uh, when I was little, we used to have pigs at home in the barn, not, not in our room, but in the barn. And in winter time, when it was like super cold in the minus 20s outside, it was actually also minus uh, degrees in the barn because there was no heating. And we used to put these very big metal uh, vessels in the barn and fill them with hot water. It was maybe like 50 liters big and so we filled them with hot water and it stayed warm for the whole night and the pigs were warm and happy. And we covered them with a blanket so pigs wouldn't get burned but they were always like pressing against them because they liked the heat that was coming from these water vessels. That's how I knew about it. And that's it. That's how you make your own hot water bottle. Thank you very much for watching and I will speak to you soon.